so today in this video i'm going to show you how can you create a fluid just in two minutes so first i'm going to delete this plan i will import uh, first i want to switch on my screencast key so that you can see what is happening in, in on the screen so i will press shift plus a and i will add a curve modifier from this curve profile uh, you can also uh, uh, use this uh, extra curves from the preferences and add add-ons you can enable the add-on of curves now i'm going to uh, uh, give this a height and width uh, like this and angle should be starting angle i will increase so that i can revolve a fluid around this and i will decrease the resi resolution to this <clears throat> okay now i will uh, come out from the edit mode and i will add a uh, sphere to this so i will go to the edit mode again and by pressing this uh, by selecting this vertex i will press shift plus s and select the cursor to select it and now i will add where the cursor the object will import at that place so i will press shift a and use uh, q uh, uv sphere and scale this down and i will use this uh, as this uh, uh, as this curve as a force path of a curve force field so i will go to this and apply curve force field from here to uh, <coughs> curve guide okay now uh, you can see uh, the end of, of this path is selected with this curve guide and start is also i will press on the q and a uh, sphere and i will uh, add a this particle system on this and i will increase this to around okay i will increase it later and also i will add a meta -bowl which is helpful for the fluid simulations which is helpful for creating water okay i will decrease the size of this metabol and for the particles you can see more particle is following the path around this so i will add this uh, uh, metabol to these particles so i will go to the render setting select this to object and for this i will select this metabol and now i will uh, what is happening the metabols is uh, flowing around this but it is not visible because we have to increase the resolution of this metabol so if i increase the resolution of the metabol you can see metabolism is visible now but it is very small so what you have to do also i will decrease to 0.05 it's the same as the result of report to the render and now what i'm going to do i'm going to scale this metabolism inside the particle system so first i will go to the uh, rotation in, in a, click to the rotation and uh, inside this yeah scaling increase the scale scaling should be okay it is not working yeah the scaling is this much and now i will uh, go to the particles again and increase the number of particles to 50000 Okay, no, twenty thousand. Now I will play the uh, the simulation. Not working. Why? Yes, I think it can work now. Just working. I can <coughs> scale this up. So that I can get the slit. Okay, now also I'm going to, after scaling this meta bowl, I will uh, increase the number of particles to 15,000. Okay.
still it is looking as meta works so I will go to again to the meta world and influence I will increase the influence yes yeah now it is looking like the water okay it is looking like the water but we have to give a shader so go to the shader report and open the um, shader editor and inside this create a new material for this and of uh, instead of this selecting you have to select this as a class psds if i select the class psds you can see our water is looking like uh, glass i will decrease the roughness and i will make it transparent by adding transparent shader with uh, mix shader so that it can mix it and we are going to enable this and alpha blend okay you can also see what it is it is looking like water if i or you can also uh, uh going to the particle setting you can change the uh, you can change the show emitter from render and you can also use the visibility uh, viewport visibility show emitter now you can see the water is flowing in this right so this is how you can create water simulation using metabolus inside blender for more uh, videos like this subscribe to our channel and thanks for watching